What's up everybody's Comics Addiction coming at you with another video and today I bought a collection so I've definitely been lagging on showing my recent pickups I'll probably do three weeks into one video but I was just too freaking excited to show what I picked up uh, I'm gonna just listen to ETA Nick's advice when he does his videos just stop saying the price stop Less competition is better. <laughs> um, especially in Southern California where it seems like everybody is hunting for anything they could find. And uh, I hit up this guy. He, We kind of came into contact through somebody else and um, hit him up. He told me, yeah, he had some books and... He told me the price. I was like, hey, could you send me some pictures? Send me some pictures. And at first, first picture was of a diaper box full of comics. And I was like, uh, the hell does that mean? <laughs> uh, now I'm not going to show everything. I'm just going to show some of the cool books. Definitely. Oh, what the hell am I saying? Some of the cool books, but the rest are just freaking awesome. Uh, I'm not sure if I will ever show but the rest is there's just way too many books. There's about two, three, four, four, five hundred books. I'm probably gonna show about 50, 60. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. I've been wheeling and dealing as of late, so a couple of these books I already said goodbye to. Uh I just gotta ship them. I officially ran out of mailers uh the rest are gonna stay in my collection whatever i decided to keep but uh without further ado let me just show you uh one of the first books i saw right away on the picture is this one marvel team up featuring spider-man captain britain number 65 i thought that was pretty cool uh i found marvel two in one I, i'm a fan of these books they don't sell for much but i'm a fan and I thought the, some of these books are really pretty. They're well taken care of. Uh, got the Marvel 2 in 1, Black Panther. The Fantastic Four, Marvel's Greatest Comics, number 77. Marvel Team Up, Spider Man, Iron Man. We got the Marvel 2 in 1. The Cosmic Cube. When I first started collecting comics, this, these two titles confused the crap out of me. Marvel 2 in 1, Marvel Team Up. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> uh, this one has a couple of ticks, but such a cool cover. I had never seen it. And a massive dog ear right here. And that's a Marvel Team Up featuring Spider Man, Doctor Strange. Uh, Marvel Team Up, Spider Man, Iron Man. Marvel Team Up, Spider-Man, Tigra. All right, let's get those out of the way. Let's see. Found this, The Journey into Mystery. I was so excited to find this book, and then I saw this chunk just missing. I was like, ah, oh, damn. Uh, I didn't look through everything. I just kind of looked through some of his collection and thought, all right, cool, done deal. Um, haggled very little. Uh, I didn't really want to... He was already giving me a good deal, and I thought I, I could live with it, so I just took a, a small discount, <laughs> and he was like, you know what, that's fine. I, I drove an hour to get there, which the climate change is ridiculous, one hour difference. I went from the, from a nice, cool, breezy 72 to a 98 degree humid weather, it's disgusting out there. <laughs> Uh, they had Journey into Mystery number 116, The Trial of the Gods. Um, this is one of my favorite covers, just for whatever reason. I guess because of the cover, they always want 15, 20 bucks. Captain Marvel number 57. I found Tales of Suspense, the first Iron Man. I don't know why I did that for. I'm gonna give it to, to 
to the Scotland. Scotland, we got Warlock. Warlock Strange Tales 181, the second Gamora. That was terrible too, so let's just go back to normal. <laughs> Ooh. I'm really close to camera, I just want to show a close up of the books. I, I, I like the other way just because I know if you're looking at a computer, this way sucks. But as of right, just for this day only, I want to show a close up of the books. So if you're watching on the phone, it'll be really up close and personal. I got Warlock number two. It's a little beat up. Now this book right here is a really underrated book. One of my favorite Venom books, which is freaking impossible to find. I can never find it and I found it in this uh, comic lot. And it's an Adam Kubert, uh, Spirits of Vengeance or crossed out Venom number six. Look at this. Yeah, like a purple, the fire right here that makes him look a little greenish. This is a wicked cover. Got this right here. Adam Kubert and Stacy, I guess. 1992. 1990s cover. Who's, who said all 90s is trash? <laughs> uh, Daredevil, number 179. Then I found another Journey into Mystery, number 106, actually very early one. Uh, for its age, it's a pretty solid shape. This one's a little bit more beat up, even though it's a, a little bit later. It's so, uh, Eminem's Want You, <laughs> Eminem's Want You, or the M's. What the hell am I saying? It's the M's. <laughs> Journey into Mystery number 114. The collection was all over the place. They had a Batman White Knight number one. Thought it was pretty cool. Uh, number five. And the Free Comic Book Day one. I thought that was pretty cool, you know. I was in there, not the whole set, which is kind of a bummer, but hey, I'll take it. I will happily take it. I got The Vengeance of Bane. This book needs a pressing. It has a couple of ticks. But uh, this is The Redemption, which I love the first and second issue where you got Bane on the cover. Just sick cover. Um, I got Logan's Run number six. This is actually uh, Thanos' first soul story, I believe. Deathstroke the Terminator. I've always thought this was a pretty cool cover. Uh, Legends number one. I I know there's some type of appearance or something. Oh, I, was, I don't know. I can't remember. Something cool was BAM! Futurama Comics number 23. Which if you guys saw what DS picked up, they stole Bender from a Golden Age cover. <laughs> Radioactive Comics, number one. And Radioactive Man, number 412. Really happy to pick these two up because, like I said, they always ask for a certain amount of money for these certain uh, Simpsons covers, and these are two of them. Something that reminded me of my childhood and extremely happy to have it. It's not going anywhere. Well, neither is this. None of these are going. These are my collection. It's an embossed cover of Gargoyles, number one. I always thought this guy looked like Nick Van Axel. If you guys watch sports, you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> um, Dark Horse Presents. <laughs> Predator. I don't know if that's the first appearance or whatever, but I thought that was a cool cover. Um, something else I found was the... Infinity War set. So you got number one, number two, number three, great Galactus cover, number four, number five, 
And number six, the Magus Triumphant. So that's pretty cool. Found the actual entire set all to myself. All right, we're starting to get to the, the big boy books. Without further ado, here I'll show these. These are the small ones. Captain Marvel, number 28. We got the Thanos cover right here. This book is a little beat up, but hey, I like it. Captain Marvel, number 33. Thanos. This is the second appearance of Thanos, if I'm not mistaken. It's Captain Marvel, number 26, He's right there. This is a. Uh, where Galactus lost his neck. The Mighty Thor 226. Frank Miller, uh, number 182. Daredevil. I got the Spider Man, number one. Every collection has this. <laughs> it actually includes the gold cover it's somewhere here. Um, you got Thor Annual, number one. It's pretty cool. Uh, first appearance of the dwarf or Eritrea, whoever wrote that. Uh, Warlock, number nine. Origin of Thanos, Warlock, number ten. They have this at 2.5, but I actually looked through it. Pages, everything's clean, all attached. There are some big ticks, but I, I just don't see the 2.5. Um, there's a certain books that I've been looking for a while and I can never find I always found this one I never could find this one I don't know why or at least in a decent uh, condition so I found death of Wolverine the set one through four that's just a cool cover which we all know that they didn't even leave them dead long enough uh, four three thirty nine I I believe that's one of the early hammers. Uh, War Machine, 282. Daredevil, 181. The Death of Electra. Uh, Daredevil, 168. The first appearance of Electra. What sucks is that uh, this guy took care of most of his books. So clearly, there's some type of tape pull right here. Uh, that's fine. It's in the collection. It's not a book I've been hunting for, but happy to have it. I sure will not lose any sleep over that part. Now this one I was extremely happy to find in there. And that's the Infinity Gauntlet set. You got one. You got two. You got three. You got four. Uh, most of these are really nice. They don't have like any type of tick. Uh, you guys do see some creases there from the bag, not the book. It's pretty cool. Number five. It's when he battles all the gods. Number six. Just a great cover. Um, that's not all. There's more. Like I said, there's a lot of great books I found in here um, just don't want to drag everybody like on an hour video of a bunch of books another one I found was 229 this is the I think this is where they talk about how 181 is coming or something like that I, I, I don't know this is I just love this cover I always wanted the cover back in the days I didn't know what the hell they were talking about it said 181 they would put a sticker and I was like wait so why is it 181 229 they charged me 30 bucks it's just a cover I want <laughs> of course now I guess it still doesn't make sense for people to charge $30 just because of that but I bought this for cheap uh, I got Marvel Age 97 the first appearance of Darkhawk I got it's gonna be random. Omega Man, first appearance of Lobo. Uh, oh, wish I could say it's almost near mint. And then there's this 
I don't know what the hell that is. This is definitely sitting in the collection. Uh, it's another book that I just was not looking hard for, just because it's been a hot book for a while. It was at like $100. Now I think it's starting to come down price, but hey, I got in the collection. So happy to have it. Uh, another book I got, extremely happy to have, and that's First Appearance of Winter Soldier, Captain America number 6. It says 9.0, but this book is a little dirty. It has two small ticks right here that do not break color, I think, which is color white. <laughs> but uh, could definitely be pressed up. Not a 9.8, but 9.4 probably. But just happy to have this. This is a freaking sick cover. You got the the these freaking Nazi flags right here. Hopefully they're on fire. You got Baron Zemo, just Captain America, just barking orders, and Winter Soldier. And the last cool books that I found, once again, all of them are awesome, but these are some of the, the ones that grabbed my eyes real quick, and that's Wolverine number one. Wolverine number two, Wolverine number three, and Wolverine number four. That's right, I did. I picked up this, uh, this is a, a great collection. I mean, this guy was all over the place, but I can't really get mad at him. I found this, I found this. Like I said, there is a lot of stuff, a lot of books, a lot of great books. Um, inside, uh, I'll just show it real quick. It's not even all of it. This is just, uh, if you don't believe me, that's the purple box of the diapers. I still need to fix all this. Uh, you got this, the web of Spider-Man. It's pretty cool. Uh, Spirits of Venom. This cover gets copied a lot, apparently. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man, Thanos, Batman, uh, some new stuff, Infinity War. This is really new, War of the Realms. Uh, this cover had sold out and I found it in there, so I was like, sweet. Uh, this is the other Spider-Man. Like I said, the gold one is somewhere. I don't know where. Uh, Blackest Night. One thing that was cool in there is uh, The Brightest Day, More Simpsons, Futurama, The Lobo first set, The Flashpoint. Flashpoint in there was the entire set. I was really excited about that. I can't wait to read that. Uh, Aquaman Flashpoint, Flashpoint Wonder Woman, The Blackest Night. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The entire thing is there, I think. Daredevil, Daredevil, some more Spider Man, Superman. You got this Ash Can, I think they call it. Uh, a bunch of Predators. I thought this was cool. Movie cover, movie cover. Just freaking Predator. Uh, more Predator. This guy loved his Predator. Uh, he had Aliens. Aliens vs. Predator. Let's see. Some cool stuff. Uh, some Magic Order. You got Batman. Uh, the Death of Damien, I think. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Batman Eternal. Couple issues in there. I don't think there's any key issue. I thought this was really cool. The Batman Black and White. It's kind of like a sketch cover. And you got the Batman Animated. Batman vs. Predator. And this one right here, the Jock cover. So yeah, this is just one box. This is a diaper box. That was in there. And I have a two more boxes. I didn't like I said, I don't want to keep you guys stuck here. So, 
that's the stuff I picked up. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And like I said, keep on the hunt, man. Don't give up. Don't pay, overpay always. Um, I know we have some awesome fellow YouTubers that give great deals. But if you guys have the time and could hunt, go hunt, man. You'll find some great deals out there, too. Hella great deals. Um, once again, go check out my 400 sub contest. And thank you for watching, man. Thank you. Till next time, guys. Later.